सो है गाइज सो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट हाउ यू कैन गेट योर फर्स्ट मशीन लर्निंग जॉब और इंटर्नशिप इन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर आई हैव प्रीवियसली टॉक्ड अबाउट द मटेरियल दैट यू नीड टू प्रिपेयर द कॉन्सेप्ट दैट आर एक्चुअली नीड टू क्लियर एन इंटरव्यू ऑफ मशीन लर्निंग और डेटा साइंस बट इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट वंस यू हैव डन ऑल दीज थिंग्स वॉट यू नीड टू डू सो एज यू नो इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी टॉक्ड अबाउट यू नीड टू लर्न द बेसिक्स ऑफ लीनर एल जेब्रा देन यू नीड टू लर्न मशीन लर्निंग एंड डीप लर्निंग देन यू कैन लर्न सम फ्रेमवर्क एंड टूल्स and once you are done with these things you are a bit ready to explore the world where you can actually use your knowledge to some concepts and uh, applic- uh, applications which you can showcase in your interview and in your resume so so projects in machine learning domain so these are the projects that i showed in my uh, domain uh, of ml during my internship so two of these projects i did during my internship and one of my project was a sort of startup thing that i wanted to try and you can see in all of them i used machine learning keras and cipro azure ml studio azure you can see and then here i again used keras and cipro scikit learn so these projects i made during my internships and the startup uh, idea and uh, all of them were uh, included the ml concept so it's very important when you are applying for a ml job it's essential to have a project which you has been using ml in the back end else if you are going to ml interview and have development in the back end or uh, uh, let's say android development web development something like that how is it going to help the person is straight forward going to ask you that okay you have done no work in ml how should we hire you because we will need to teach you everything from scratch if it is a campus placement there is a chance you can clear but if it is off campus i don't think anyone is even going to consider you in that case now how to find project so some project ideas uh, you can get from websites like geeks for geeks data camp then you have youtube uh youtube is the best place i would say you can so work with alongside some of the uh, channels like free code camp org and then you know build some basic apps and from them you can make some ch- minor changes then some major changes and come up with your own application of ml then you have github github has a lot of ideas of uh, current applications you can you know clone them make some changes add some new features of yours else you can start with hackathons you can participate in hackathons and side by side when you are building a project for that particular theme or concept your side project for your resume gets ready you can work on kaggle dev post unstop or lablab.ai all these contains machine learning and data science hackathons i know a lot of you guys will rec- tell me about uh, other websites also which contain these th- uh, hackathons but to be honest these are the four websites where you actually win prizes you can get internship also directly from winning the hackathons and uh, your side project is obviously getting ready so that is a very good thing right so yeah next thing is linkedin so once you are done with this how you are you going to apply for jobs so you are going to search for machine learning intern you are going to see a lot of jobs here right you can apply to each one of them you can apply to this jindalex job then you have supra and like this is just a, a thing i searched today and found out now there are a lot of other websites also where you can apply like linkedin then you have well found then you have monster then you have nokri.com all of these contain jobs so definitely don't uh, like don't think like that you are not even going to consider these portals go see if there is opening apply there you never know uh, when your luck plays the game and uh, you know luck is a very important thing when it comes to job openings it's a very high chance that even if you are not that much capable uh, and p- people who are capable more than you uh, won't get noticed because you applied early and some recruiter came uh, just came across your profile and scheduled an interview and somehow you were able to clear it so luck plays a very important role so don't miss any chance that you see now second is have a good linkedin profile you know this is my linkedin profile uh, before this uh, get, getting my internship and full time at yellow i was uh, an intern at iit jodhpur before that i was working at kisan pro and before that i was in omdena so all of my four years i was working somewhere or other so i added everything here so that anyone who has a look on this will get an idea that okay this guy has been working so he has an experience and keep your linkedin file up, uh, linkedin profile updated have a good uh, you know profile pic because profile pic plays a very crucial role if you don't have a formal profile pic it can cause problems to you then if now people are going to ask vishesh we are in second year how should we able to uh, get some good experience in our profile i agree get into some clubs do some technical work there work in the domain you want to apply let's say data science here and add that in your uh, linkedin profile experience that will play again you know something is always better than nothing you you, you will understand that because uh, there's a chance that if you have worked in some specific thing let's say langchain or fast api and that company is looking for okay exactly this tech stack 
then they are definitely going to consider you why not and uh, linkedin profile plays a very crucial role because this is you know branding you this is the page which actually tells the brand value of a person so yeah have a good linkedin profile second is i'll show you a video uh, i will play this so let's say you go to this open ai page right uh, you search for technical recruiters and once you search it all the list of av available recruiters will be there so in the people section you can see these are all the recruiters so what you can do uh, you can search for director also and then you can go to this profile and ask these people to uh, you know consider you if they have an opening but do this if they already have an opening because most of the time there is no opening and people won't be able to do much right so let's say this he's the account director so he's not the best person to go for ml jobs right so do things thing wisely one more thing once you have us we have found these people let's say you don't want to reach them out on linkedin you consider okay i i see a job opening but i don't think reaching out on linkedin will help because these people get thousands of message every day so let's try something new let's get a bit personalized you know there are tools which can help you get the email ids of these people but you know guys use this tool very carefully only use this tool if you have a good profile and you see a job opening don't randomly send mails it will help you nowhere and it will get you blocked so these are the two tools i will show you uh, yeah so the first is the email finder about uh, that is get prospect and the second is contact out these tools are provide uh, I, i think 50 credits each so 100 emails you can get every every month by free so you have 100 emails to send and use these tools very wisely because your email also has a score so if your email are constantly getting uh, in going into spam section by the employees with whom you are sending so your email won't have any value so use them very wisely only use them when you are very much sure that okay i am fit for this role and uh, there's an opening and these people uh, will respond to me so uh, it's fine you can send i think more than 300 400 emails you get, will get reply only on 2 or 3 so don't keep a lot of hopes on these things but this is a very important thing cold emailing this whole concept is called as cold emailing and i got my job like internship through cold emailing only so i saw that yellow is a ml company so i just decided that okay i need to work in ml domain so i think i should reach out to one of them and tell that i am good in ml i think i can contribute i have a good experience in that things that your company is using and i decided that now this is a sample template of the email that you can send uh, first of all hey this is vishesh tripathi a uh, final year student wanting to join meta i just put a random name now you can tell the answers that why you want to join meta why apply at meta uh, like the best project that you are currently proud of you can add your resume linkedin portfolio and github for people for people to make sure that okay you are a capable candidate you are you have confidence and you are providing some proof that okay i am capable of, capable of getting this job i should get this job so yeah you need to follow all these things and i think if you have good knowledge and you constantly follow all these things let's say this is not a procedure that is going to end in 2 months maybe it can take 6 months but i can assure you if you follow this uh, procedure it is definitely going to help you land a job in 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 6 months it won't take more, more than that if you have the right amount of skills so yeah that's it so yeah that's it guys uh, i'll i'll end this uh, with this uh, pick of uh, the hobbit house Uh, because i consider we we all are like hobbit house right we we have warmness inside us and uh, at the end this small door has a has the opportunity to give you a, la a ton of jobs that are present in the market so yeah thank you guys and have a nice day